Hi guys, Matt Thomas here at Cedar Rock Studio Guitar Gallery in Indiana. And today I've got one of the most amazing guitars I've ever personally heard in person. This is a Mission Grand Kevin Ryan. Uh, if you haven't heard of Kevin Ryan's, just look up some of his stuff. It, it, some of the techniques and building concepts that he's doing are really innovative. Um, and we'll get into that shortly. So first off, this top, is one of the tightest green Adirondacks I've ever seen. And it is so thin and open and resonant over top of really old growth brass. I mean, the, the swirling in that center strip next to that super straight grain is unreal. I mean, this is probably my favorite set of Brazilian I've ever seen in person. Um, it's also got a Brazilian uh, back head cap and ebony front face. Um, Ebony binding down the neck with rosewood trim all the way around the back and sides. And it's also got a lovely abalone face all the way around an abalone rosette. The specs are pretty standard at the nut width is one and three fourths and the saddle is two and a quarter. But what is quite unique is this is fossilized walrus tusk. So it really really generates the energy to this top board. Um, now one of the things that is really unique about Kevin Ryan's is this actually doesn't have tone bars. It has an enlarged bridge plate that is laser etched with a honeycomb pattern. And they've really analyzed the, the frequencies of each instrument and it shows. This guitar just sounds so large and huge in person. Uh, I'm sure that it sounds like that on the recordings too, but it vibrates your whole rib cage. I mean, even through your back. So <laughs> uh, I, don't, I won't need to see a chiropractor after playing this guitar. <laughs> um, what else can I say about this fantastic instrument? The, the neck profile is really wonderful. It actually feels nearly flat back, which I prefer for finger style so I can keep my thumb seated on the back of the neck. And the volute just cradles your hand perfect. Um, there's not really anything about this instrument that I can find at all wrong. I would sell every of my guitars to have this thing. And I may, so buy it before I do. <laughs> uh, if you have any more questions about this amazing Mission Grand, make sure that you message Alan at cedarrockstudio.com. Thanks.